skin disorders and cosmetics. Every day, thousands of women have reactions to the makeup they use. While this is a relatively small percentage of the population, there is cause for concern nonetheless. For those women who cannot leave the house wearing makeup, be sure that you are using quality products from reputable manufacturers. Cosmetics, especially those made by less than scrupulous companies, can cause serious long-term problems for your skin. One of the most common problems caused by the use of cosmetics is irritant contact dermatitis. This is generally characterized by an intense facial itch and an accompanying rash. This type of skin disorder is usually caused by the use of facial cleansers, toners, and astringents. These products are generally very acidic, and often contain alcohol. If you find that your skin is irritated by these products, you should refrain from using them immediately. Then make an appointment to see your doctor or dermatologist. Another skin disorder caused by cosmetics is allergic contact dermatitis. This occurs with less frequency than irritant contact dermatitis, and the appearance is very hard to distinguish from other types of skin reactions. Symptoms generally include redness, swelling, itchiness, or blistering. This type of reaction is caused by an allergy to one or more ingredients in a particular product. In case of a reaction, refrain from using any cosmetic products until the reaction has subsided. An antihistamine will help to reduce any itching that you may be experiencing, and your physician may prescribe a corticosteroid to reduce inflammation. One condition that seems to be appearing with greater frequency is cosmetic-induced acne. A great number of cosmetics on the market are left on one's face for long periods of time, and this can cause the skin pores to become clogged. These clogged pores will often develop into blackheads or pimples. Treatment for cosmetic-induced acne is the same as that for standard acne, appropriate creams or gels, and or oral medication. Applying makeup on these areas is strongly advised against. If you wear makeup during this time, be sure that it is oil-free. While this is hardly an exhaustive list of conditions related to the use of cosmetics, they are the reason to pause and consider your particular situation. We all love to look pretty, and makeup generally helps us accomplish that goal. There are alternatives to wearing excessive amounts of makeup, and I have heard that the all-natural look is really making a big comeback. If you cannot imagine going without cosmetics, be sure the ones you are using are designed with high-quality ingredients. There are a number of all-natural products available, too. Explore your options, and speak with your dermatologist about any concerns you might have. Your skin will thank you for it. If you like this video don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, click the bell button for notification of the upcoming videos, and share to others. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.